I have prepared three icons for download. Under icon folder, create a new folder and give a specific name as you want. Drag and drop these icons into the new created folder. Right click on the selected icons and select bulk edit property matrix. Scroll down and change compression settings to user interface. Text to group change to UI. Then save all changes. Return back to content folder under configurator folder Blueprint folder create a new folder called POI Right click under user interface Select widget blueprint Give a unique name as you want. Double click the widget to open. On the search palette, find canvas panel and drag it to hierarchy panel. Make sure it is fill the screen. Then find button and drag onto the canvas panel. Button is selected. Modify the X and Y size to 70. On the detail panel search box, find padding and set it all to 0. Next type draw as and change all to image type. Now open the POI icons and select icon number 1. Return to widget editor. Use the arrow button to apply the selected icon. Do the same thing to hover and press button. Go back to content folder under POI folder. Right click and create a blueprint class. Select pound blueprint and give it a unique name. Open the POI pound, find the add plus button and look for widget.
widget is selected. On the detail panel, change the widget class to target the POI widget. Change the space type to screen. Set the pivot all to zero. Draw at desired size is checked. And disable the gravity setting as we are doing user interface. And make sure collision preset is set to UI. Press compile and save it. Go back to the scene. Select one of the blue box. Press Alt button to duplicate and move it to the center. This will be a target focus of our POI blueprint. From the content folder, drag and drop the POI pound. Move it to the top center of the box. Disable alignment settings as needed. Press play to do a test. Now our widget is visible during gameplay and it will follow our camera at any direction and position. See you in the next step.